Hello, this is Techie Doodle Doo, and today we will have a look at some more accessories for the GoPro Hero 9. And today we will start with what the GoPro calls chesty. So this is a chest mount for your GoPro. It, it fits every GoPro that uses the standard finger mounts. I, and it includes a thumb screw, this quick release mount, and the, the chest mount itself. So it has um, adjustable straps. This, these go over your shoulder and are adjustable for yeah most people. And then this go around. These straps goes around your chest. These are also adjustable on either side to get the most comfortable fit. While we are looking at this angle, this hair is the part that goes against the chest. There are texture here to make some good ventilation and it's quite soft padding. It's not that thick but it's more than enough because the GoPro isn't that heavy so it doesn't need to have very much padding. You can see that the strap goes around on, on, on the back side here, on, just on the one side. That's because on the front side here, you can see underneath this quick release mount, we can push down this to release it like a standard buckle. It fits into these slots. Oh, like that. This makes it easy to take on and off the, the chest mount, so you don't have to just, just take off the GoPro and then the mount. You can just take it off with this heat clip. It's not that easy to get off, okay. So this is like a somewhat, no, it's quite hard, but it's soft like plastic. It's all nut. This part is soft, this part is more hard. Yeah, it's a great addition to to when you want to have a, a real point of view that is comfortable to wear. I, by my experience, uh, it's very comfortable. You don't feel the weight of the GoPro at all. And since the back part is so slim, except for this, but this is a, on a part of your back that you don't feel it. You can use it with a backpack without feeling it too much. Okay, and that's that. And the next accessory we'll have a look at is the head strap. The head strap also comes with this quick clip, which I call it. It's, yeah, you can see the ribs here. It's for mounting on a hat or a belt or your backpack. And by my experience, it's it it's very sturdy. It's, it's if you have a strong enough surface to mount it to. And this is the head strap itself. It comes with this thumb screw. And this goes against your head or forehead. It's adjustable in both the height of uh, over your head and on the width of your head. And it has this. Yeah, silicone wiggly line, which make me, which make it really quickly. And um, I have short hair, and I have no problems with it. It doesn't feel very heavy on my head. And also, if you have long hair, it's uh, I have heard that it fits real nice, even if you have long hair. It doesn't slip off easy. Yeah, it's easy, adjustable to our all head sizes and it's really comfortable. So you get a perfect point of view when you use this. The next accessory I want to show you is the GoPro tripod mount. 
So it comes with three things in the box. It comes with this quick release, which we had seen earlier in this video. It has two mounting points for the standard tripod mounting, but it has two. So you, some tripods have two points of uh, fastening it for more stability. And we have this. Uh, it also comes with a thumb screw. You can just take it out to show you. So this is the, the just a straight uh, to the tripod mount here. And last but not least, it comes with a small tripod. So this has long legs and it's quite low profile. So the legs go out quite far and it's very stable. But it it doesn't have any rubber pads here, so it it can slide around really easy. It can also be used as a as a monopod. And yeah, it's not as nice as the shorty. It uh, has some structure here, but yeah, it's just nice to have, I guess. Okay. The next accessory I bought is the maybe least exciting one. It's the extra adhesive mounts. So you can see here, this pack comes with uh, three of the curved. Um, this is the curved one, isn't it? Ah, oh, this is the curved one. Okay. So this is curved. This for mounting on a curved surface like a helmet or a. a, a Part of your car body or motorbike or yeah whatever you want to fasten it to and it's a flat one it's three three of each but i did experience i just have to find it oh this is one i tried to mount this one to the dashboard of my car and it was on a hot day and it didn't want to stick at all it just fastened in the corners but uh, it's demonstrative when I'm driving just normal, but if I bumped into it, it did fell off. So don't mount it on a hot day, I guess. And the last thing I want to show you is these cases. So I, I bought two of them just to get to carry all my stuff. And it comes just like this. It's a nice soft but, uh, case, but it's, it's completely soft. It doesn't have any hard structure in it. Um, it's not watertight, but I guess it's somewhat watertight. And it has a nice zipper. It makes a lot of noise. And um, it has this pocket which is a mesh uh, fabric with a zipper here. Perfect to put in your uh, memory cards and stuff. And we also get this divider in, it, in here. So the way I pack it is I take the divider from the other one and put it like this and then I can organize all my things inside so i put all my mounts here a quick release mounts here and the, the smaller stuff over here and i get to put my uh, the included tripod over here and yeah i've dismounted i also put my shorty in there and in the other case the, the chesty, the chest mount, it fits perfectly in there together with the headband. Just, yeah, I didn't put it in perfectly now. But, so it pulls on the things I have to the GoPro. It's not as nice as the included one, but the one that is included with the GoPro when you buy it. That comes in a hard case. But it does, it, it's somewhat smaller. I'm going to show it this one. So, this one is a bit wider and 
almost as long. But yeah, you want a hard case for your GoPro. So I can put my GoPro with the medium on and the short in here, extra battery, a quick release mount, and a little hatch. Maybe put it inside the zip lock because I don't want to scratch my GoPro. So yeah, this has been my video on all the GoPro accessories I have. Do you have anything that you want me to try? Any accessories from, it doesn't have to be from GoPro, it can be third party as well. Leave it a comment below. So don't forget to subscribe and uh, click that like button. And also remember to click on the bell so you get a notification next time we upload a video. Have a good one.